Hey guys, Tara here. Welcome back to the match of the Rocket League Championships. This time, match number 24 up against the Expresso, a match between two of us who are calling it inside of the playoff places. I think we're definitely, I think we're ahead of the Express coming into this match. We get a nice other the ball inside of the Express, so that's definitely where he needed it to be. We get for a nice hit, clearly, I guess we do get a nice hit controlled here as well over to the side. We can try and get for a hit towards the goal, we do our usual shot, hitting the ball up towards the goal. That's going to try and come down, try and get for a shot. Oh, just gets a little bit of a deflection, I think. But Possibly could have gone in without the deflection, but I don't think we were quite at the right angle to make the most of the opportunity anyway. Where the ball. I like where the ball's been so far in the side of the Express, and now we can just try and find the goal, that'd be even better. And then Wolfie though, actually passes the ball out of control, give a shot, yes we do, yes we do, get the shot! I thought we were just the goalkeeper though, just going to get it for a second, but Wolfie, using the shot that we used to a professional, was that Wolfie? That actually, no, that was slider there, hit it out. So the shot that we've done, the rest of the team now are finally catching on to it. It's a shot that works. Now we take the lead with just after 30 seconds of the match. You know, so I'm starting up front as well, so try and go for a faster, try and get some aggression going. You see where the ball comes into our side, so not the best start in the world. You see the ball is still coming towards our goal. You know, we actually, we, well, we could have gone pretty clear, but we actually ended up missing the ball completely. A nice save there, actually, from Wolfie hitting right down towards the goal. That, that, if, that, if that had gone in, that had, I think would have been the slowest goal ever, so I'm actually... I'm actually glad that they, they stopped that ball then. And the ball's still actually all over the side of the audio Express, so we've definitely been in this first minute of the game. I think we have as a shot there from side as well, so yeah, we've definitely been the better team than the Express in this first minute. So once, the, once, once we don't play the bottom teams, we actually start doing good again because we actually sort of predict how they play. The stock completely erratic is how they play. They're actually more kind of like predictable. And the ball still come back down to a half and a one hit later, and we send it. We're sending it flying through the air, we actually get a wall hit right for once. Actually a nice hit actually, send it right back down towards the goal, but it's just going off the side and actually gets a deflection for one of the three. We get a nice block once again, so... I don't have to say that, me personally, I've definitely been playing a lot better in this game so far than I have done in a long time. I've actually been a lot more involved in the match as well. And actually with my shots and all that, some deflections or... whatever, the, the passing there, I've definitely been a lot, a lot more successful as well. And then almost two minutes of this match gone already, so this match has actually gone fairly quick. I mean, matches do go fairly quick when... You're not losing 3-0 after maybe two minutes, that's what it has been for the past few matches. And Slider gives us a second goal now to give us a two-goal advantage. Let's see how he got this then. As uh, Wolfie there comes in, there's a little bit of a deflection. It's not going to be an own goal, is it? So, well, the goalkeeper there is trying to do something with the ball, but just left himself open to attack. And Slider's not going to say no to that. That's right now, we're starting in the middle, are we? Yeah, Slider, there's nothing really we can do off this restart. If the, if the ball comes towards us, we might be able to do something. As you know, the Wolfie there comes sliding out for the goal. As you know, we've out there. Oh no, we've got an open goal. Come on there, Wolfie. Oh no, Tusk gets a goal back. What was he doing? I think Wolfie was the one in goal. It's Wolfie, yeah. Wolfie just comes shooting in. I was, I was lining myself up to go back for the ball. Wolfie should have stayed in goal. And then we got Sundown. Just, there was just nothing he could have done there. Because if he hit the ball, the ball will always move faster than the car if it gets hit properly. Now, starting in the middle again, let's see if we can do anything this time, because the ball's still coming towards us, I'll try and come another shot, you know, it goes right over the top of us, and then we get right towards the goal, oh, great save there, though, from Wolfie the Wolfie, he's learned from his mistake, so it's good to see there, learned from his mistake last time, charging out, he's not the way to go, making a save there, now the ball's still right back towards the goal, now, of the express, they're going to try and go for our, our pattern to shoot, corner shot, clear, and right towards the goal, we just missed it there, I skilled myself, I thought I was going to go but the ball came down a little bit slower than what I uh, thought he would have done, and go for shot, and there we go, there we get the redemption now, got our second goal of the match and give ourselves back a two goal advantage over the Express, so yeah, after I skilled myself, Wolfie there is doing absolutely nothing, so I don't really know why he just completely stayed still, but I'm not going to complain, it's a, it's a goal for us and that's what we need. And then starting up front again, see if we can go try and get a good first touch, yes we do, and the ball comes actually back into our side, he was looking good for about a split second, and then the rest of the Express just came charging to hit it into our side. And it's still getting towards the goal. Towards our goal. Actually, actually is a double save there, actually, from Wolfie. I don't know how that was classes like two saves. No, Wolfie's just completely getting in my way. So I don't really know uh, what Wolfie's mindset is for this match. He seems to be uh, quite all over the place, anyway. But he seems to excuse me! That's going to be that kind of match, is it? Just because you're losing, you don't have to go and blow me up. And Slider scores a goal. Not that I saw it, because I'm only over the other end of the pitch. But I want to say that's Carver for exploding me there. So how do you do this? Wolfie passed the ball out. And Slider there to pick up the pieces once again. So the, yeah, these corner shots, they're working out such a treat for us, so obviously I'm not surprised why there's not many other teams that have actually caught on to this yet either, so it just seems to be like our move. Well, we created it either way, but I'm surprised you the teams aren't actually catching on to it yet. And now then we've got two minutes of the match left to go, and we've got a three goal advantage, so things are looking good for now, but you know how things always go for us, we, we could end up being about 50 goals down in the next 10 seconds, nothing. All of a sudden, there we go, you get an explosion, 
And hopefully that was on the one that uh, blew us up before to get them a bit of extra cover. And then the ball coming back down towards our goal now. Can we go for shot there? No, we do. Tusk gets his second goal of the match and maybe giving a slither of hope to the Express with a minute 46 of the match left to go. I think it was Tusk that scored the other goal as well, so it looks like an, an army of one here for Tusk trying to actually do something for his team. And starting off front once again to try and go for another fast touch, but hopefully the ball gets to the side of the Express. Can we get a nice hitch, do we? Actually, uh, after all the rebounds, the ball finally goes into the side of the Express, so uh, where it needs to be. Uh, is that Wolfie going to try and pass the ball out to us and try and get shot? No, I think they're catching on to it now. At least, at least how to defend our shot, probably haven't gone and go for a shot of their own because we've been such, such the better team despite us being an army of one scoring two goals. Such a so our defense has definitely been quite a bit better if you, if you don't care. Wolfie, I think the slider gets his hat trick now, I'm pretty sure that is. And uh, well, the goal disappeared, so uh, fortunately, the, uh, the replay skipped. So you can't really see how he scored his hat trick, but it's still a hat trick, though, nevertheless. What's like now? We get for a nice shot, it's going right towards the goal. That's another goal, and we're four goals up now on the Express team. Now we get our own hat trick as well, and the uh, replay doesn't cut out this time, so uh, yeah, at least it doesn't cut, at least it doesn't cut out mine. And a, that was a fairly simple goal. Those, those kind of goals are really satisfying because there's no of the other players in goal, so nothing they could have done to uh, stop that. Now then, a minute 17 left, I guess. There's still plenty of time for something to happen here, so we can try and get a few more goals. And the ball's still coming back now towards our goal. It's going right towards the corner, is it? And Tusk gets his own hat trick. So it was like three players getting their getting hat tricks. So Tusk, not to be outdone, the army has won. He's definitely he's going for it. You've got to give him credit for that. So uh, even if the Express don't win, I think he should be the honorary car of the match because from just the, the absolute work he's putting in for the Express team. Okay, the first touch in the ball actually makes his way into the side of the Express team this time, so uh, definitely a bet, probably one of the best results we actually had in this game. Now they've still got uh, just a minute of this match left to go now. We try and get another goal by trying to get back to a four goal lead. If you, cause someone comes in for a shot, they think that's Sundown doing the shot just a little bit there off target. And now the ball's still fighting all the way around. It's going to try and get some boost now back into our side. Because here comes the ball now actually back now into our side. Ryan Q for us being over here. Okay, actually, no. Oh, great. Okay, that's, that's going right towards the goal. We need to try and get this away from the goal, do we now? And Beast. Uh, Beast has actually woken up. I think. I don't know where Tusk was, but Beast actually woken up. But now, is this is this the turning point of the game? Is this, is this where the momentum shifts back to the Express team? And Wolfie there was in goal, but it just couldn't do anything about it. It just wasn't close enough to the ball. And this time, we're the ones starting here, goal. So hopefully. We try and keep the ball away from our own goal this time for the next 40 seconds. I'm just to solidify a victory at least, but then again, I want to get some goal eventually because well, with the goals that we lost to the Seekers and the, uh, the the other bottom team in the past few matches, that's definitely taking quite a hit to our, what was our goal difference, but goals per game, that's definitely going to be going away from this match. And then still got 20 seconds of this match left to go, still plenty of time for something maybe to happen. And just try and keep it down the express. Just let's try, try and get another goal. Try and get because every goal could be crucial. There's no draws in this match. It's win and loss, and then goes off uh, your uh, goal difference. That could have been a goal there, but it's just all of them just running the ball to save it now. Only a few seconds in the match left to go, so I don't think we're going to get another goal. But still, it looks like it's going to be victory. And the ball touches the floor. Indeed, it is victory there for Renault. And who gets car of the match? It's uh, Slider. So, well, me and him both got hat tricks. So uh, I think Slider must have done quite a few other things as well to actually get the car of the match over us. Because we got all the uh, first touch points as well as we go up against the Rovers in the next match. Because the Skyhawks beat the Bombers. The minus guard victory over the Rebels. The Seekers beat the Rovers. And surprise, surprise, the Guardians won another match this time over the Dragons. Another top six side. So, pretty good win for them. As we're now, we're, we're up into third in the second. I can't remember if we were in third actually last time. But still, it's the Guardians that lead with a four game win advantage over the Monarchs. And we're in third with the Express in fourth. With the Skyhawks in fifth and the Dragons right off the playoff places. And then we've got the Bombers in seventh. The Seekers actually get out of eighth place and get out of ninth place now into eighth with the Rovers and Rebels at the bottom of the table. So you want to leave a like if you enjoyed this video. Leave a comment down below. Subscribe if you're new and hit the notification bell so you don't miss out on any of my future videos. And check out my Facebook, Twitter and Instagram. They'll be linked in the description down below. So thanks for watching. I'll see you all next time.